go. Is Johnny Wilson the fire first on lane five? Woo! Yes, John. Perfect start. The folks behind us in the uh, concourse tell you all you need to know about that first ball. Perfect. Oh, and we can see seven and eight as well. Yep. It's the only matchup we'll, we'll miss is uh, Richie Hipkins and uh, Colby Dean Dennis. This worked out perfectly. Yep. My kudos to the tournament admins. Yeah, I can give I can give periodic updates. Like for example, we've got matching strikes from Richie Hipkins and Colby. Oh, on. I think Buddy just hit IHOP. I'm pretty sure he had the two seven eight. Oh. Three nine ten. Three nine ten. Great shot. Matching strikes on 11 and 12 for Rich and Colby. Uh, Matt Buckingham, a good first ball, leaving the four pin. Strike for Matt Kruger in the first. He's up on a strike against Steve Dreyer. Dreyer had a 10 box to start. Colby DeAntonis, double on 11 and 12. Matt Buckingham on lane six converts his spare. Nice shot, Kyle Bull. The guy just doesn't stop. One, two, four, six for a spare. Hey, that's a very rare sight, folks. You might want to rewind and watch that again. That is a spare from Kyle Bull. Kyle Bull, strike on spare. There's the strike we're looking for. Ah. Matt Buckingham, terrible break. That was, that was a very good ball. He'll have 18 in the first. That's plenty. <laughs> Over on 11 and 12, Richie Hipkins goes spare on strike. So he's at 30 plus in the second. So is Colby, but Colby's on a double. there. Kind of, kind of unique. Um, Buddy Turner on one and two, counting seven on his spare in the first, leaving the one, two, seven. Opposite a spare strike from Kyle. Matt covers for ten. So not a too bad start for him. 28 in second. So Buddy Turner on one and two is down three pins. 30 to 27. Up on a spare. Kyle on a strike. Johnny Wilson coming back, looking for the double seven pin stance. Light hip got a really good break out of it. He'll take nine and run. Steve Dreyer over on 11 and 12, eight spare, giving him 48 plus in the third. Will be on a double. Johnny at the seven, slides left. <laughs> Back-to-back, -back, 10 boxes from Steve Dreyer on lane 7 and 8. He's at 20. His opponent, Matt Krieger, 30-plus. 10 box for Johnny. 9 on that, 10 out, 29 through 2. He's got a one-pin advantage over Matt. Buddy Turner in the third off the side on his spare. Takes 8, shooting at the 1-3. Has them both. Three spares in a row for him. Colby counted very low on his double, only five, but he came back and made the spare, so he's 55 plus in the third. Johnny Wilson, meanwhile, on our feature pair, a nice ball for the 5-8. Five, five, Kyle Bull going for yet another double. Gets it. He has got it. Are you kidding me? The guy just doesn't stop. This is a strikes versus spares matchup on one and two. I mean, this is just unbelievable. Kyle shoots 2,160. 13 and now comes back spare double in his first match of the final. This might be might be his day. Just might be. I don't want to speak too soon, but it might be his day. I believe Johnny went wide there on the 5-8. Hey, both of them I picked before we uh, got into the bracket are still alive. Who is that? I had Bernie Hipkins and Buddy Turner. Or not Richie Hipkins. Richie Hipkins. Yeah, my mistake. Well, okay, not a double, not a triple there, but Kyle leaves just the 10 pin. Colby, meanwhile. Nine counted on his spare on lane 11, shooting the 10 pin. He's got it. 
74 plus in the fourth for him. Matt Buckingham trying his Mount Airy Classic. Uh, doesn't quite get there. Kyle Bull. Another spare somehow. He got two spares in one game. Wow. 79 plus in the fourth for him. Matt Buckingham staring down the head pin for a spare. If he gets it, he'll be tied with Johnny up a hit. Spare conversion for Matt Kruger on lane eight. That is three marks in a row for him. He's at 48 plus through three. And 19 pin lead and a hit. Matt covers. Matt will be taking the lead. Not a good break Light there. hit for Buddy on his spare. Well, okay, somehow trips one out, gets seven. It's a little better. It's a little easier to 52 make. in the third for him. Richie Hipkins staying right hot on the tail of Colby. Both of them all marks. Richie at 67 plus in the fourth. Oh, that is one ugly break. The 2 3 9 10 for Matt Kruger. Big hit from Buddy. Nice shot from Buddy. Matt drops them all strike on spare. 10 pin lead for Matt, and he's got the strike going in the fourth. 10 pin slide on seven. Rough break there for Richie Hipkins on his spare, trying to keep up with Colby if he leaves the 4 6. So more than likely he'll be open. Sorry, the scores are coming at you. Uh, fast and quick. I'm just trying to give everyone updates on the, the matches they care about. I know we only see a couple here on screen. Strike for Buddy. Buddy Turner has gone five marks in a row and is going to be behind. He's at 82 plus in the fifth. <laughs> Jeez. Same thing that's going on down there. They both start out four marks in a row when Richie was behind. Richie took eight on, nine out. A very nice 84 half, but still trailing. Kyle, 79 plus. Sends it wide, he knew he did, but he caught a break. 1-3 standing, 8 count for him, 87 in the 4th. That's a 15 pin lead after 4. He'll want to keep a spare conversion here to uh, maintain the advantage. Colby off the side, looks like he just left the head pin. Uh, 7 pins there too. Okay. It's hard to tell from this angle. I see a 9 count up there. Okay. Kyle, Kyle picks on his 2 pinner, so... Uh, the gap will narrow a bit. Kyle, a very nice 96 half. He is up 14 pins down a hit. A little delay here on five and six, waiting for that respot to be done. Colby covers five marks in a row for him out the gate. 93 plus through five. Ooh, nice bid there from Matt. Again, Kyle 96 through five on an open. Hasn't had many of those today. Oh, okay, well, get it a little closer. Is it an easier version of the 136? Is it? I'd say so, yeah. As long as you hit the three, you hit the six. Yeah, Colby yeah, D'Antonis awesome. strike on spare. He stays red hot. 113 plus through six for him. It's not that pin. I think there was a pin in the cutter. Oh, well. Need the uh, six pin added to lane. Yeah, they're calling it lane one. Or are they? Dryer slid the ten pin nearly into the gutter. I'm not even sure that will pick it up. Oh, we got it. It will, cause as long as it moves horizontal, it can pick it up. If there's anything, anything vertical, no chance. Johnny slides by the four seven. Steve does cover. His first mark of the game, 39 plus in the fourth for him. Colby's all marked through six. Looks like a 10 box there from Richie. So after six frames, it is 113.94 in favor of Colby. Colby up on a strike. Got to roll around, doesn't get there. Five pin standing for Johnny. And five through the middle for Steve on his first mark of the game. So he's at 43. Fourth in the middle, 43 in the fourth. Opposite of 60 from Matt. Johnny shooting at the five. Has it? Spare in the box. Ten. Sorry, ten in the box for him. 57 through five. Matt already 58 plus through four. 
Kyle is going to have his second consecutive open. Nine out again. 105 through six. A chance for Buddy to come back. Yeah, open the door for him. Mark here from Buddy, and he's, he's going to take the lead. Especially with a double. Let's see what happens. Matt Buckingham up on lane six looking to double. Oh. And he does. Wow. Great ball. Double, Matt Buckingham, 48 in the third double, fourth and fifth. Gives himself a nice cushion in that game. Matt Kruger catching, I think, a good break there. I just see the 10 pin standing. Ooh, buddy, buddy Turner not catching a good break. 5 10, no push in the belt. Almost did. So, at a minimum, he's at 90 in the fifth, so he'd only be behind six. Um, if he goes 10 out, he's behind five. Well, actually, no. He, he can get really, he can get really close here. Skin's gonna get nice and close if he doesn't convert. Let's see what happens. Good shot. Oh wow, what a bid. Matt for a triple. Seven off the side. That's, that's, about to hit him in here. that's plenty of count. 69-49 on seven and eight after five frames. Matt Kruger with 20 pin lead. Buddy goes 10 out very gently. 101-105. Kyle has a four-pin lead going into the final four boxes. Matt shooting at the rail. Covers nicely. He's got plenty of a lead now. 95 in the fifth with a spare in the sixth. Colby at 132 through seven. Richie Hipkins at 103. Matt Kruger drops them all on lane seven. 79 plus in the sixth for him. Big ball from Buddy. Solid five. No. Oh, Never man. mind. Wasn't solid it's enough. All of them. It just crumbled down. So that's a big. That's a big mark. Yes. Very big mark. Johnny Wilson, solid ball for the five pin. Colby at 141 through 8, Rich 103 through 7. Kyle off the side for 6, leaves the 1 3 5 10. That's three frames in a row, he's been off the head. I need to shoot the five to get some kind of comeback going. He's there. Nice shot, Kyle Bull. One, three, five, ten, all down. So he maintains a four-pin lead. The only thing he's got to worry about now is a double from Buddy. Pin out front. Richie going for the double on 11 and 12 doesn't quite get it. I think he's got a four pin standing up. Kyle on his spare. Is there again. Messenger in front of the seven. A nice nine count giving him 124 through seven. Which is sad because that's actually like behind average pace for him today. I think it's about his average pace today. 124 through seven. Shooting at the seven pin. Got to go attack it. Gets it. Just slides it in on the left side. Huge mark there in the eighth frame. 134 plus. This game here on five and six. Matt Buckingham is up 38. And hits, hits are even. Might hit. Might get that. Might take the 10. He's got the 10. Nice nine count there. Buddy Turner, his only way to take the lead is with a double strike. Spare, and he will still be behind. Oh, he's it's there, and got it. Double strike. Buddy Turner. No better time for it. Now, count becomes very important. If he does not strike, his count becomes very important. And what he leaves. If he counts eight, that's fine. But if it's you know if it's an ugly split, then you'd much rather a lower count and something makeable. Colby one fifty one in the ninth. 
Richie Schmidt, 133 plus that game. It's not quite over yet, but uh, the writing is on the wall. Colby, uh, a mark to shut out. Triple attempt here for Buddy on lane one. Oh, no. Ah. Only two. 123 in the seventh. Kyle stays in the lead. Colby just punched out the 1-5, needing a mark to put Richie on a double. Game's not over over there. Hey buddy, brings it back. Great shot. Kyle will need nine spare to stay tied. All right, Richie Hipkin is going to need a mark to beat Colby. Colby finishing out with 159. And that might not be enough. Kyle, he's there. Messenger seven, down it goes. Kyle headed into the 10th frame up, 154, 153. Kyle has the advantage being on a strike. Oh, wow. Three, seven, nine, 10 for Matt. Okay, Richie Hipkins has his work cut out for him. I believe that's the 110 standing up. Oh, with some extras. It's only a six count. Let's see what happens. He did cover. Cow for a double. All right. Catches a break. Matt slides off. Good try at that, though. Okay, Kyle is shooting just the six pin, right? No, ten there too. Six ten, sorry, six ten. The ball returns in my way. Six ten for Kyle. Has them both. What a huge shot. One seventy four and a ball remaining. I don't know how they finished. Yeah, only one. Okay. Colby won on 11 and 12. Uh, Richie Hipkins finishing out with 156. A very nice game, but not enough. Kyle wants them all. He has eight more. A very nice 182. Buddy, nine spare strike to tie. Strike and any kind of spare to win. Buddy must... Buddy must get at least nine on this ball to stay alive. An unbelievably close, very high scoring Are you sure match. They're bowling a one and two. I, you know what? These guys have been dialed in all day, yes, and especially you know Kyle throwing a million. I mean, this, that just that just raised his average. That's not even funny. If there was a 14 game world record, he's got that too. But he must have nine or more. Good ball. Oh my! You got to be kidding me. Eight. And Kyle moves on, even with a conversion. If Buddy were to convert and put a strike on it, he would shoot 181, and that would not be enough. Kyle Bull, by the thinnest of margins, is going to move on. Buddy is going to shoot 170 something and lose. That was a hell of a game. Unbelievable match. It's hard to count out Matt Kruger. He's kind of locked up. No, nope, that that game's over. The game in the middle, two games in the middle are over, but the two on the end were very exciting. One eighty, was it one eighty two? Yes. One eighty two, one seventy one. What a match! Yeah, Steve Dreyer had a very tough game on seven and eight. Steve at eighty eight for nine. Um, Matt is just uh, coasting here. It'll get, it's gonna be Matt Kruger, Colby D. Antonis, I believe. That's how that works. Yes. And then we're gonna have Matt Buckingham and Kyle Bull. And Johnny, Johnny took a good shot to try to bring that back in the ninth. He threw a very good first ball, but ripped the middle. Yeah. He could have had a double there to try to bring some pins back. There you go. Just keep raising that average, Kyle. You have people following along on YouTube? 
Okay, so I'm glad that we were giving updates over there then. Because that was, wow, what a game. I'm glad I didn't move. I was almost going to move the camera, so it just showed five and six. I'm glad we kept we kept it on one and two. <laughs> yeah. So, semi and the semifinals on three and four. The finals on five and six. <laughs> he averaged 166. <laughs> oh, boo -boo. oh man, that's terrible. What a shame. <laughs> what an awful game. <laughs> Middle match is finishing up. Nice shot there by Matt Kruger sliding the 2-6. Matt Kruger is going to be in the 160s with five marks in a row to end. Matt Buckingham uh, going to be in the 150s. Spare for him. Give him 149 and a bowl to go. Okay, very nice game there for Matt Kruger. 161. Fantastic scoring still, even in the uh, quarterfinal. Let's hope it keeps going. Get some big scores here on three and four. All right, nice game for Matt Buckingham. One fifty-seven. Steve Dreyer, eighty-eight in the ninth. Going to need twelve pins for a hundred. Gonna be hard to do with that. Uh, he's, uh, well, uh, well, okay. I don't know if the seven's standing. The six is. See. Oh, the seven is standing. Oh, it is? Yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding me. He almost had the five, six, seven. Wow. Well, oh, a one mark game for Steve, unless he can convert this. Johnny cleaning up there. Johnny can max out at 130. Steve going for it. Oh, nice try. It'll be a one mark game under 100 for Steve. Just a good weekend for him, but an unfortunate conclusion. One court again. Hey, Johnny Wilson maxes out 130. But it's going to be 96 for Steve Dreyer. Very uncharacteristic game for him, but you know sometimes they don't fall your way. And that'll do it for our quarterfinals.